It's a precious resource and we're throwing it away. Whether it's rural or whether it's urban, about 10% of premises have hidden leaks. Apartment owners with new individual hot and cold meters are alerted to leaks before their money runs down the drain. And uh, we have one unit, tarp running and tap is running. And the quarterly bill comes $1,250. This device allows people to monitor their actual water use and then pay accordingly. It also often leads to reduced consumption. Our total levies have reduced something like a half a million dollars a year. The chip that powers this device was developed by cattle farmer Gordon Foister, who's no ordinary farmer. He helped to develop Wi-Fi and holds a master's degree in artificial intelligence from Stanford University. And we looked at applications that needed to send small amounts of data over many years of battery life to send at long range. Rural Australians like this cane farmer on the Queensland coast also benefit. It sends a, a, a message to my phone that tells me when everything's ready to shut off. Soil moisture sensors on this 40 hectare farm send an alert when water carrying fertiliser and farm chemicals reaches the end of a row of sugarcane. It's to stop nitrogen enriched water reaching nearby coastal rivers that run onto the Great Barrier Reef when nutrients can trigger algal blooms, a factor in coral bleaching. So we've been able to demonstrate that we're not getting any runoff. Farm water use is now monitored using meters linked through a system of interrelated computing devices known as the Internet of Things, which could soon make remote controlled farming a reality. Farming is on the, the brink of a new revolution. This is farming that will be uh, controlled by Internet of Things devices. South Australia is the driest state on the driest inhabited continent and in Adelaide, underground sensors send alerts about problems in water pipes. There are about 10 million water metres in, in Australia and we're on a couple of hundred thousand. Um, we'd really like to be on all of them. Councils along the Murray-Darling may soon increase metering to monitor disputed water use there. Ricardo Gonsalves, SBS World News.